guys welcome back to Android tutorial uh, in this part of this tutorial we are going to learn how to find the current orientation of your phone you can see that many Android applications are available in both mode orientation and landscape so it is very necessary to find out the current orientation of your phone or Android device so now in this part uh, I will briefly explain how to uh, get the current orientation of your device so just open up Eclipse IDE I will explain it will be a complete uh, working example so I just create a project in the Eclipse IDE I create a project with the name orientation demo project here is the main activity Java file here is the XML layout for the XML layout for this project so in order to get the current orientation level to check whether the uh, current orientation level is landscape or portrait you have to get the current display information of your device so orientation is a display information so you have to get current information display information of your device so in order to get the display display information of your Android device you have to create an object of the uh, window manager class also you have to get display information uh, using an object of the uh, display class so first of all first of all you have to create an object of window manager class so I just create a, an object of the window manager class here manager is equal to uh, using a method called uh, get window manager the next step is you have to create an object of display class I just name it as display I just create an object of display class here uh, with uh, manager dot get default display so now we get information about the current display information is uh, get on this object now we have to check the width and height of this orientation of your device uh, if it is in landscape mode definitely the width is greater than uh, its height so uh, now here I just check it if this dot uh, get width greater than this dot get height uh, that means if the uh, width of your orientation is greater than the height then definitely it is in landscape mode so I just display a toast here toast dot device now in landscape specify an orientation here specify the length of your toast I make it as long uh, if the else part of this loop definitely it is in uh, portrait mode so the else part it is definitely in portrait mode okay uh, now we have to check the project so first of all uh, this is the emulator Android AVD uh, you need to know how to uh, change the AVD 
uh, how to change the orientation of your AVD. Uh, this is now this the uh, now the orientation is in portrait mode. Uh, you can change the orientation of your AVD by using the short key Control F11. By pressing Control F11, you can uh, change the orientation of your AVD. Now I just change the orientation here. You can see that now the orientation is changing into uh, landscape mode. Again, plus Control F11, it will again restore into uh, portrait mode. Now I just now I am going to run the project. Okay, now the project is learned. You can see that a toss this appear here, device in uh, portrait mode. Now I just change the orientation into landscape. So now I just change it into landscape. Now you can see device now in landscape. Again I change into portrait. Now you can see the device now in portrait mode. Uh, guys, this is how you can change or you can detect the orientation change of your Android device. Uh, in the next part of this tutorial, we are going to learn how to uh, restrict the orientation change. In certain situation, you need to maintain the orientation in landscape or portrait. You can see that in, in case of some uh, games, you can see that the orientation is always in uh, landscape. In the next part of this tutorial, we uh, we are going to learn how to control this orientation of your device programmatically. Okay guys, thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next part. Please subscribe my channel for further video updates.